I'm, I'm so excited to be up here and actually be able to practice and throw balls and run balls with the team. So it's, it's really fun. How did it feel getting out there and just playing? And do you feel like you mixed in with the guys well? I feel like I do. I do. I'm still learning a lot of stuff, though, but they're helping me as I go around. Uh, you are a true freshman, but you clearly don't have a true freshman body. How do you feel like you're – what do you think your role could be on the team this year? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to practice hard and do what I'm supposed to do, learn the plays and learn – just look through the playbook and everything like that and hopefully I can go on the field. Do you feel like you've got a shot to win in this running back competition? Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure yet. I'm just still learning the plays and everything like that. They're helping me as I go along, so we'll see. Is there one part of the game that you feel like you need to work on the most? Uh, not really. Just, just practicing and practice hard and learning the plays and everything. So. How, how much of the Beavers did you watch last year? Uh, I watched a few games that was on TV and stuff like that. And then my visit, my official visit, I watched the game. So. Clearly, they're trying to change the attitude around here, kind of get it that wide, that bad taste from last year out of their mouth. I mean, what do you think it's going to take to get them back on the winning path here? Just practice hard and stay motivated. That's about it. Uh, do you feel like the speed from high school coming to yeah, college level now like is going to be different for you? Wasn't, wasn't uh, I think it's going to be different. So I think I can uh, you know, get a coke to it, but it'll be the same, you know. Do you really want to, how badly do you want to play this year? Or has anybody talked to you about red shirting? Or what do you, what's your feeling? I want, to, I want to play real bad. Like, this, I've been practicing hard. I studied a playbook all last night. And I'd rather want to play. You've been hanging out with other running backs. What have they been telling you? Yeah, they're just telling me to keep uh, keeping my playbook and everything like that. And only plays and ask questions if I need anything. How are you? How okay. far along are you in the playbook study? Uh, I just got the playbook last night, so yeah. I'm still learning to play. So we go. So what's it like being a new kid in town, but still a guy who can claim number one spot at running back? I mean, do you, how much do you assert yourself? How much do you kind of play back and learn? Um, I'll, I'll let the guys just go first, like in the um, drills and stuff, so that I can see and learn like how to do it and where to go and everything like that. And then I just wait for my turn and I just do the best I can. How, ba how badly do you think the team needs to establish a running game this year? Uh, I think that if we all practice together, work hard, study the playbook, that we all be effective and we have a great running game this year. I gotta ask on your number. Uh, are you a Quiz Rogers fan, and you're from Texas, right? Yeah. <laughs> that way he's a little Texas. Yeah, I used to live in Texas. But I picked it because um, cause I like the number, and plus um, I feel like if I had the number, it would motivate me a lot to fill his shoes and probably even, like just be the best I can. And I that was available. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, guys, uh, you know, talking about Malcolm, you know, he was a guy who didn't play last year. Um, you know, I talked to him. I know he said he wanted to play bad. Um, do you think that's a possibility to kind of do what he did last year and maybe, maybe get that chance? Uh, yeah, I'm just taking notes from him, like he said, just stay in the playbook and learn plays and do everything right. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate it, man.